Hey guys, Luke, and will Barry be remastered in True XS game? I'm gonna say maybe, but today I'm going to be doing more of a discussion rather than just straight up quick baiting you guys with quote unquote confirmed information for a game that we don't even actually know the name of yet. I just want to discuss the possibility, the likelihood, and what it would mean for the storyline in True XS game as a whole if Barry were to be remastered. So first we have to define exactly what kind of remaster this could be. There are two real routes that would likely be taken. One is a true form remaster where it's just enhanced graphics with no new quotes, easter eggs, or anything along those lines and sticks to the storyline continuity that we've had since Black Ops 2's original release. The other scenario is to do a complete rework of Buried, including a change to a brand new easter egg entirely with a cutscene showing what happens after Richtofen takes control of Samuel's body, because right after that we're not really sure as to what happens between then and where the zombies comics pick up with Richtofen having a zombified body, so it'd be nice to have a little bit of a plotline fill in for us. And this is probably the least likely scenario because of all the information from the comics that could be gathered, it could really all be explained pretty quickly in a trailer or an intro cutscene that serves as a way to bring the transit group back into the fold. Like I discussed in my last video, the snare would probably only happen if Treyarch was to do another Chronicles type situation, which right now is about a 50-50 toss up. We do know the transit crew is going to be featured in the Black Ops 4 map as the playable characters, and the reason that we know that is because Treyarch would not spend so much time and money producing the comics just to have it fill in a little bit of information on past events. This is pretty evident with the comics ending and the transit crew being frozen underneath Mob of the dead and being saved for later. There's a theatrical principle called Chekhov's gun, where if you introduce something in the first act, then it has to be used by the last act. Basically what that means is since the trans crew is introduced, they have to be used. Now this could be in a remastered or reimagined map, but at this point we really don't know. It'll probably be in a brand new map where, like I said, they just get reintroduced in an intro cutscene, or they get reintroduced in a trailer, and then everything is fine and we keep going on with the story. But in the end, every single bit of this video really comes down to does Jason Wondell want to go back and change Black Ops 2 storyline to make it try to fit in with the future of the mode. Obviously he has plans for them, we're not sure what those plans are at this point, but because he reintroduced them and he kept just pushing it and pushing it, and because he just kept teasing the Black Ops 2 transit crew, we know that they're going to be in Black Ops 4 in some way, shape, or form. And getting back to Barry Remaster, Treyarch has so many avenues to relay information to us nowadays, instead of having to reintroduce stuff within the game itself. Itself, they have the comic books, the timeline which can be added to, trailers, teasers, posters, obscure marketing campaigns, literally anything and everything at this point could and will be used by Treyarch because they only have a limited amount of time to make these maps and tell a story and they want to push that story forward instead of just continuing to look to the past. And does the community want an updated version of Buried with new stuff? Hell yeah we do, but is that going to happen? Probably not. As I said earlier, if anything, we will maybe get a remaster of Buried in a Chronicles type way, with some updated graphics, maybe a few new quotes, and a few side easter eggs. And I don't think that we're ever going to actually get it within the regular 4 DLC season, and I don't think that we're going to be getting it as a pre-order bonus. That's just my opinion on the whole situation, though obviously I could be wrong. But like I said, this is just my opinion. Tell me in the comment section down below, do you guys think Buried's going to be remastered in any way, shape, or form within Black Ops 4, or whatever? Treyarch's going to call the next game. I really, really love to hear it. Or down there, appreciate a like, subscribe if you guys are new around here, turn on notifications, you know, the typical stuff a YouTuber tells you to do. Anyway, I do love you guys, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace. What the actual, oh my god, what the actual fuck did I just do? Oh my god. I am a goddamn legend. Uh, anyway, so...